The 2015 Radio Indaba, focusing on old and new school radio, has bemoaned the lack of research, non-scripting, lack of orderliness, and poor programming. Attendants spoken to blamed it on technological changes. This is what they said. To agree with the, 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 the general membership that has gathered in the, this Indaba, as we are looking at this, there's been a, 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 a serious laissez-faire attitude um, I believe uh, due to a number of challenges and changing ch changes that have come through in radio. Much as we would like to agree that uh, radio is dynamic, but the dynamism of radio has not been checked as much um, considering um, the fact that um, uh, there hasn't been much preparation, there hasn't been uh, much content that would add value to um, uh, um, a grouping of people or particular communities as it were. I, ha I have realized or seen that uh, most radio stations and station owners are coming through into this industry either for the money and not necessarily for the passion that uh, most of us are in for. However, we have uh, noticed that uh, DJs have not been as the DJs of yesteryear. I think uh, that during our time, we would sit in the library to prepare our shows. We would prepare, um, you know, uh, two hours or three hours before your show. Uh, sometimes you needed to draw your your your, your vinyl, your records, um, a day before for you to, to, to manage a show very early in the morning. Uh, meaning there was so much preparation and research which does what which is lacking yeah technology changes have actually made significant uh, um, efficiencies come to effect in, in radio today i'll give you an example if there is a riot in a certain location um, you actually would have to report it two three hours later on your main news bulletin and i want to think that scooping is the name of the game in in, in the media but with technology today you could have a uh, your information generated by users on different platforms like Facebook, you can pick up a lead from there, you can pick up video from YouTube, uh, and several other platforms that you can collect that, verify, and then you could quickly actually air it. Also, it's improved. Um, you could be on air on a particular subject, you're talking garbage collection, for example, and then one of the participants, one of the live callers, just stares the conversation into another corner. By that, you could go straight onto your desktop, uh, connect your internet, and you can verify certain facts and add flesh to it. So when the presenter is giving um, or hosting that interview or that show, they're able to give their comments from the informative side. And that actually improves the efficiencies in, in as far as um, comparing the old school and the new school style of radio. Though technology has added much value in production time and content, the endeavor is urging media practitioners to mix the old and new school radio in developing the industry to the benefit of communities and the country. This has been Sylvia Chere reporting for Mama Sosa, Nalcon Shoes, New Zambian Innovations.